All right, so Tom, now that you see it in its place, what do you think? I'm really happy. Tell me why. Well, uh, whenever the conceptualization works, I mean, working with the committee and what we, uh, what the goals were for the commission, um, and just, I mean, as an artist and as all the hours I put into it, um, to actually see it come to fruition, it's really exciting. And I'm really proud of it. And Kevin, what does this mean for Dickinson State? Uh, it means a lot. It's a great moment and marking the spot of TR's speech and, and just a new vision and a great place to move forward. So, really excited. It's amazing that it's now the 2011 and this is the first public <laughs> statue of Theodore Roosevelt in Dickinson. That is true. And even in Western North Dakota, and you read about you know the letters that were shared and those type of things where TR said, wait, there's someone else more deserving. and could have been on the Capitol ground, but it's best that he's here in Dickinson. So. Uh, that letter basically stated, um, Teddy said, I'm not deserving, I'm not old enough, and I haven't done enough, and he did a lot. And so it's just one of those factors. So they were willing to put up a statue of him back then. He said, wait, yep. I'm not, I don't yet belong Anyone. in that way. That is true. And so now we're writing that wrong. <laughs> exactly. A century later. <laughs> and I think if history could rewrite itself, they would want him to be in in front of the state capitol, but we have him here in Dickinson, so um, it's just a great benefit and will uh, become a walking tour and tie the community as well as the university together in a lot of different fashions. And at a time when the story appears to be energy, there are lots of cultural things going on. That is true. So who's this Tom Bollinger? Oh, he's a great guy. <laughs> a great alum, so uh, we're really excited that Tom was commissioned to do this and is here to help install it today. And Great alum from 78, just a few years ago. Tomorrow's the big day. Uh, Friday's the big day. Friday, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, getting ahead of myself. <laughs> exactly. So, so what happens Friday here? Friday afternoon, 3.30 uh, is the dedication and the unveiling, and so it'll be a, a fun afternoon um, to officially open this site um, and have a number of speakers that'll be here and give a lot of presentations and talks. The choir will sing and... Uh, I think people really enjoy what they see uh, a young hey, can Theodore you take Roosevelt that and what's going on. So. Or that pallet? And uh, the city and the county played a role huh? in this. Yeah, the city and the county, especially no, the county, no stepped up and yeah. allowed this to be placed on their property, those type of things, and re landscaped the entire front, um, front of the courthouse. Uh, but yeah. each of them okay. contributed financially, the city and the county, in order to make it happen, along with yeah, a number of donors.